making a slip knot now. So now you are going to make chain 72 for toddler. Okay. So like this you have to make chain 72 okay and please make sure it should not twist at the end okay so like this so you can do like this then it will not twist just insert the hook in the last uh, chain and then insert the hook in the first chain and then continue making the chains like this okay so one two like this you have to make totally 72 chains okay should not twist so i have completed 72 chains now now i am going to make a slip stitch okay so now chain three one two three two double crochet in the same chain okay one and two okay two double crochet in the same chain so then chain one then skip three chains so one two three and then you are going to make three double crochet in the fourth chain so one two three three double crochet okay and then chain one and then skip three chains so three double crochet in the fourth chain one two three okay now chain one skip three chains so you have to continue the same pattern skip three chains make three double crochet skip three chains make three double crochet till eight clusters okay like this so you have to make eight times three double crochet so i have completed four now one two three four so you are going to make four more so I have completed totally 8 3 double crochet 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay now chain 1 and then skip 3 chains we are going to make a 3 double crochet chain 2 this is a corner of the dress okay so 3 double crochet chain 2 again 3 double crochet in the same chain two three so we just created one corner now okay so again chain one skip three chains so you are continue the same pattern for again eight times so this is a first time three double crochet chain one then second skip three chains then second time three double crochet so you have to continue this for again eight more times i mean eight times okay skip three chains like this same pattern continue okay till the next corner one two three so five more you are going to make so i have completed eight times three double crochet now eight okay now skip three chains again we're going to make the next corner so in this dress two corner will be there okay so one two three chain two then three double crochet in the same chain three 
then chain 1 so skip 3 chains now to do a slip stitch in the top of the third chain then again slip stitch you are going to make a slip stitch till the space okay every time you are, you are going to make a slip stitch till the space so I am going to change the color so if you want you want you can also change the color otherwise you no need to join the yarn directly you are you are uh, I mean you can do slip stitch in the space so first round completed now second round chain 3 2 double crochet in the same space 1 then every time the chain 3 count as 1 double crochet ok so, so totally 3 double crochet now then chain 1 and then 3 double crochet in the next space so 1 2 okay then chain one in the next so every space you are going to make a three double crochet from now one okay till the end of the dress okay. so you are just continue this till the corner okay the same pattern okay so I have completed now in the corner I am going to make three double crochet chain two three double crochet three double crochet in one space okay in the same space so every time you are going to do the same every corner you are going to make three double crochet chain two three double crochet then chain one again three double crochet in the next space so this pattern will continue again one two and three so continue till the next corner okay So I have completed and I have reached the next corner. So now in this corner you are going to make 3 double crochet chain 2 3 double crochet again. 3 double crochet chain 1 then in the next space 3 double crochet. Okay. So second row we are going to complete now then again chain 1 then slip stitch in the top of the 3 chains then again you are going to make a slip stitch in the second stitch and then in the third stitch and then in the space so every time you are going to do a same so I am going to change a color now so now again we will start a third row now chain 3 2 double crochet in the same space 1 and 2 then chain 1 3 double crochet in the next space So you just continue the same pattern for 10 rows totally okay just continue the same 3 double crochet chain 1 3 double crochet chain 1 continue this for 10 rows I have completed 2 now so I am going to do 8 more rows so, so every corner you have to make a 3 double crochet chain to 3 double crochet so continue the same till 10 rows so I have completed now okay 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay now we will start working on armhole now okay so you just join the front and back portions and so corner side one okay and then this one two then three four five then six okay so in the middle of five and six we are going to this is the armhole okay so we are going to make marker marker here okay after 5 ok so we just created so this is the armhole and then again left side armhole create we will create so 1 2 3 4 
phi ok so after phi we are going to create a marker marker here this is the left side arm hole so i have just created a right side and left side arm hole so you just count it and confirm so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 okay this is for left side okay same 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so this is for right side okay so you just finish it off the 10th row okay like this okay you just doing a slip stitch in the space then pull the yarn cut it out the yarn and then tighten the yarn that's it okay just to finish to the 10th row like this okay now i am going to start working from the corner so we have just created one side arm hole here right side here and left side here okay so now we'll start working here to this arm hole to that side arm hole okay so this space we are going to make a as usual three double crochet in the corner three double crochet chain to three double crochet okay so we will be working from the corner now okay we just insert the yarn like this and then make a knot okay now just turn your work and then insert the hook pull the yarn and chain 1 okay now 1 2 chain 2 and then chain 3 okay then two double crochet in the space one and two and then chain two and then three double crochet one two three okay so corner created then now chain one then three double crochet in the next space as usual so pattern will continue one Two, three, then chain one, and then three double crochet in the next space. Then chain one, then three double crochet in the next space. Chain one, then three double crochet in the next space. chain 1 then the arm hole we reached right so here we are going to make a three double crochet as usual chain 1 and then you have you just turn your work and then we are going to make a three double crochet in the other side of the arm hole here okay so three double crochet 1 2 3 then okay so we just created so chain 1 this storm hole then three double crochet chain 1 three double crochet chain 1 three double crochet chain 1 three double crochet we reached the corner now so in the corner as usual three double crochet chain 2 three double crochet 1 2 3 chain 2 3 double crochet chain 1 then three double crochet in the next space
chain 1, 3 double crochet in the next space. Chain 1, 3 double crochet in the next space. Chain 1, 3 double crochet in the next space. Then we reach the arm hole now. Chain 1, okay. Now 3 double crochet. Chain 1, and then just turn it turn your work and then you are going to make again 3 double crochet in the other side of the arm hole like this. Two, three, then chain one, and then three double crochet in the next space. So we are going to make uh, continue the pattern like this till you reach seventeen rows. Okay, total seventeen rows we are going to complete. So already we have completed eleven rows. Okay, this is the eleventh row, right? So we are going to make six more rows to complete the dress. Okay. So go ahead and continue the same pattern. So chain one and then slip stitch to finish it off the round. Eleventh round completed. Then again slip stitch again slip stitch. So till the middle space we are going to make a slip stitch like this. Okay. So I am going to changing the yarn. So you just continue the same pattern okay so three double crochet here and then in the corner here also three double crochet only so only corner you are going to make three double crochet chain to three double crochet continue the same for 17 rows okay so i have completed 17 rows now so just see okay One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and a seventeen. Okay, I have completed seventeen rows. Okay, now we are going to start working on tassels. Okay, here. Okay, you you can take any of uh, I mean items like this. So I am going to take this then. I am going to take one yarn and then rotate the yarn like this one this is first time and this and then hold it like this okay and then this is the second time I am going to rotate then this is the third time. So I am going to uh, make a tassels you using three colors multi colors so, so I am just cut it off the yarn and then I will take another yarn. And then I will do the same three times. I will rotate. Make sure you just hold it tightly. Okay. So one time, and then two time, and then three time. Okay. So and then I will take a another yarn. So if you are using a same color, then no problem. You just continue the, to rotate like this for six times, using a single color of yarn. But I am here I am making mixed color tassel. So I am going to make like this. Okay. So this is a third time. So you just cut it out the yarn. Now just cut it out the all the yarn from the below. Just hold it tightly. Yes. Okay. And then cut out the yarn. And that is it. Okay. Now I will take the yarn bunch. I think the yarn bunch is little thick for me. Okay. So first you will arrange the yarn. All should even. Okay. Evenly you should arrange the yarn. But it is little thick. So what I am going to do is. I will just take each yarn from one color okay so three yarns i will take so every time you are going to rotate two times only so 
I need little thin. Okay, so I'll take only six yarns, two yarn in each color. Okay, so six times you are you 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 are going to rotate. So that you make sure. So you just arrange it and then you just hold it like this. Cut it the yarn. It should be even. Okay, you just hold it like this, and then just hold it like this, and then you just insert the hook from here. Then pull the yarn like this, and then again just insert. Then pull the yarn bunch like this. Okay, you just you 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 will use um, big size hook here. I don't have, so that's why I'm using five mm hook. But if you want, you can use nine mm hook or seven mm hook or anything, whatever you have. It will be very easy to for pulling the yarn. That's it. Okay, and then once you pull, you just tie the yarn bunch. Okay, one tassel is created. Now you just uh, cut it. Uh, you just arrange all the yarn e evenly, and then you just cut it out the yarn like this. Okay, so I've just created one tassels. Okay, now I'm going to uh, make tassels like this for next space. Okay. So I will take one yarn and then I will rotate it two times first. Hold it like this, okay? One time, and then this is a second time, okay? Then you just cut it the yarn. Okay, and then you just take the another yarn. And then again two times you have to rotate like this. Make sure please hold it tightly. And then third time. Just cut it out the yarn. And then just uh, tight the all the yarn and then you just cut it out the below part. Like this, okay and then take the yarn then you just arrange the yarn evenly okay just um, arrange the yarn like this and then hold it and then we are going to make a tassel like this okay now in this space are going to insert the hook like this and then just pull the yarn from here to inside and then again go it on it over and then again pull the yarn like this okay and then you just pull the yarn tightly. Okay, we just created tassels in two space. Then you just continue this for all the spaces. Okay, till this front side and back side. Thank you.